G'day, g'day, hello, you going? Welcome to GFYS Gaming Australia with your pilot, the Aussie Rambo, Microsoft Flight Simulator, here today, here on this Monday afternoon, the 7th of September 2020. How you all going? Hope you are all safe and well. And we're going to be going into lockdown Victoria here this afternoon and uh, taking a, a little trip around Melbourne, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I did try to do this uh, one earlier today. But it turns out that, uh, yeah, we are in a, uh, uh, didn't have the sound. So it turned out that, uh, yeah, we couldn't do it. Anyway, um, don't want to put it up on the channel without any commentary, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, so what we're doing here today is, um, I've got a dude that actually sent me a link uh, that I've been talking to um, uh, personally about uh, some details to be added to the game. And uh, he was telling me certain things that... Uh, uh, taking a bit hard to uh, do some things, so yeah. Um, mainly the Dreamliners. I was asking him why, why is there no skins for the Dreamliner airplanes, but anyway. Uh, today we're going to be uh, taking a trip uh, from Melbourne International and we're arriving at uh, this uh, place here. It is a bit cloudy here this afternoon. It's, it's sort of typical Melbourne weather, is it? Um, <laughs> uh, all right, we're, today we're going to be taking the Diamond Aircraft out, right? We're just going to go for a little bit cruise. Uh, so we're going to take that. Uh, and what we're going to do is we're going to fly over in the Melbourne CBD. Uh, and uh, check out the uh, mod that uh, the guy linked me to, which actually is the first official stadium in Melbourne. Now, you're probably thinking the Melbourne Cricket Ground. Well, I wish it was. But um, no one has still, after two weeks of the game being released done, uh, officially, not done Melbourne's Cricket Ground. Like, come on, this is one of the world's famous stadiums, the Melbourne Cricket Ground, and it's not officially in the game. Very disappointed, actually. And also, London's um, Wembley Stadium is not officially in the game either, which I found a bit disappointing as well. It is in the game, but it's like flat on flat slap in the ground. It's not real, you know. Like, uh, this uh, this uh, originally had uh, the stadium that I'm about to go to, which is Marvel Stadium, ladies and gentlemen, uh, a.k.a. Docklands um, in Melbourne. And... Uh, you people might have already flown over it and, and seen that it's squashed in the ground and it looks unrealistic. Uh, well, uh, say no more. It's not like that anymore with this uh, particular one that I'm doing. So let's get into it and uh, check it out and see uh, it for yourselves. It actually got the Marvel logo on the side. It's pretty realistic, um, I can say to you right now. So we will show you as we go over it and uh, around it and whatnot, and uh, do a couple of tools around it. All right, so uh, don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, check out our Microsoft Flight Simulator playlist. It is the best area to go to, because when we do live stream for uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator, after we finish the live streams, uh, there's nowhere else uh, you can actually see the live streams if you if you haven't watched it all or you, you've missed half of it or you just joined us towards the end of our live stream and you want to watch the rest of the live stream. Well, you can very quickly uh, because the only place you can see the replays of our live streams first on our YouTube channel are on our dedicated Microsoft Flight Simulator playlist. So... Go there, and then you'll see exclusive content before anywhere else on our YouTube channel for the game. As I'm just uh, swipe wiping my um, Logitech uh, mouse pad that I'm using here. I've just got a cheap one for the moment. Don't want to light it up with fancy stuff. I've got a light fancy stuff going around my professional table that I've custom built um, f uh, many months ago now. Uh, so, yeah. All right, let's get into it. I do apologize. It does take a long time for this game to load up. That's just the norm of this game. It always has done that. Uh, and it's just, yeah, something that's a bit disappointing for me, actually, the, the loading time. But I don't know if that's maybe because I'm using the four-year-old graphics card, well, almost five-year-old graphics card now, GTX 1060. But, uh, yeah, it's... Um, hopefully... Uh, it's uh, just the graphics card because I'm upgrading to the big banger that it is coming. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I'm getting a new computer and everything sorted out, hopefully uh, by February next year. Now, I have said I promised things in the past, but this time I sort of want to legitly... Melbourne Tower Diamond Alpha Sierra X-Ray Golf Sierra ready for south it. departure at runway 34. 
Diamond Alpha Sierra X-Ray Golf Sierra cleared for takeoff runway tree for departure to the south. Yeah, folks, I don't know what this tower is over here, but, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's like a big, giant, massive tower in the middle of Whoop Whoop, and it's not part of the Melbourne CBD area. Anyway, uh, let's, uh, follow the, uh, so-called, uh, one of the freeways just here. I'm not sure if this is part of the Hume Highway or not, but, uh, yeah, it's, uh, Never been to Melbourne before, ladies and gentlemen, but I do know a bit of bits and pieces of uh, stuff where things are. Uh, we will be uh, near the airport going over one of the we uh, big Westfield shopping centres that goes over the, uh, the main highway down there, one of the main highways. So, uh, yeah, we... Uh, I don't know what that tower is over there. It's just like something that you probably should be actually located in... Um, Should be actually located in uh, Melbourne itself, but it's not. Okay, let's uh, slow down a bit. Uh, we've got to do get a go into Melbourne CBD area. freezes up on me. What's that Essendon Airport? So there's another airport there. Oh, there's Melbourne's CBD over there. Yeah, so I don't know what that tower is over there, folks. Uh, what's this guy? Guy me. <laughs> you, if you're from the Sutherland Shire, you're a fuckwit. <laughs> That's St. George of the Warrior talk there, folks. We hate, we hate the Shire. All right. Well, so the purpose of the, uh, this flight today here on this uh, Monday, the 7th of September 2020, folks, is uh, to go and check out Etihad Stadium for you guys, or former Etihad Stadium, Dockland Stadium, Marvel Stadium it is now known as, and it actually has got Marvel Stadium on the side of it. So, it is the current, which is uh, pretty cool. So, we're going to fly into it, and uh, it's on this side of uh, the CBD here. go a little bit over this way before we do fly into the CBD and we'll just go to Flemington Race Course. We, in my eyes needs to be um, fixed up proper legit as well. I reckon it needs to be uh, corrected. It's just one of my uh, many things I'd like to see added to the game. Have the 
proper legit building for it and everything. Like, this doesn't look. Uh, it looks all right, but it's not. Um, Fully, fully re realistic in my opinion, but anyway, that's just me. Looks alright, it's not bad. Anyway, let's go and check out the first official building in Melbourne, ladies and gentlemen, added to the game Marvel Stadium. And there it is in front just there ladies and gentlemen, that's Marvel Stadium, this is officially in the game now, it's a mod. Now does that look better folks? I think so. And we will officially let you know that it is Marvel Stadium by flying around it again and uh, showing you the side view so you can see the uh, logo on the side. I would like somebody to actually do the official, you know, roads and buildings in the whole of Melbourne, not just the MCG. Oh, I'm surprised the MCG's not done after all these weeks, folks. See, you can see Marvel Stadium written on the side there, see? There you go. So you know it's legit. How good is that, folks? Awesome. Now we just need the MCG to have the bloody same thing. Because that thing just there is supposed to be the MCG. It looks like a bloody round bloody crown casino. Same with um, the Marvel Court Arena and uh, Rod Laver Arena and uh, Amy Park. Like the outdoor courts, yeah, that's all fine and everything, but look at that. Jesus Christ. Like. That's supposed to be the Melbourne Cree ground. That's fucking pathetic. And that's supposed to be Rod Labor Arena in the ring. Like, and that's supposed to be... Look at how... Alright, fair enough. It looks alright, but it's, it looks in the ground. It's un, unprofessional. I want it properly, legitly, all done correctly. You know what I'm saying? Like, Eddie Ad's, uh, Eddie Ad Stadium. I keep calling it Eddie Ad Stadium. Do apologise. Um... You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it needs to be properly done um, with uh, Corbin Tower Diamond Alpha Sierra X Ray Golf Sierra is one zero miles northwest with Charlie to land. Diamond Alpha Sierra X Ray Golf Sierra. 
I see somebody has done a Washington DC uh, pack in the game now with all with a lot all the real buildings and stuff. Uh, it is a paid mod. Even if it was a paid mod for Melbourne and Sydney and you know, at least would have the proper legit stuff, you know. And that's what I'm looking for. Yeah. You know? Same with Auckland as well. You know. And I mean like not just the city itself for Sydney and Melbourne and that, I want the surrounds and everything, all the suburbs and that, pop of buildings and stuff, you know? Like, have Luna Park in St Kilda and have Luna Park in Sydney, um, added Anzac Bridge in Sydney, Glazeville Bridge in Sydney, the Ride Bridge in Sydney, um, you know, pop of stuff, you know? Because ANZ Stadium here in Sydney is not realistic in the game. Like it's just flat in the ground. It just looks shocking. know where Charles side in shopping centre is in here. Even with the real, I want the realistic shopping centres added to the game, you know. I'm not sure if this is it or not. I think this might be it. I'm not sure. What is that supposed to be, folks? I don't know. Like, uh, I don't know if that's a Westfield or... I don't know. Was that Charles site? Charleston? It's Charleston, is it? Chadston?
Okay, I sort of know where it is now. I'm going to go sort of back towards it. See if I can spot it out. I think that might be it. I think that one I went over might be it. Yeah, I think that is it. What I went over. Yeah, I'm gonna probably call it now. That was uh, that was definitely it. What I was talking about, Chadston, I think it is. It is uh, Australia's biggest shopping centre. Yeah, Chads Chadston, the fashion capital they call it. So about 530 shops. Yeah, looking at this, it definitely, uh, yeah, I'm looking at the road, dip, the road thing and that, and that now, that's it, that's legit, that's Chadston Shopping Centre, ladies and gentlemen, in the game, and it doesn't even fucking look like it. So just here, ladies and gentlemen, Australia's biggest shopping center it doesn't even look like it I want to see somebody actually put the legit one in it and the sky roofs and everything so that's it there ladies and gentlemen Chadston Australia's biggest shopping centre, so not at Westfields. <laughs> so, I'm surprised Westfield haven't actually decided to take it over. Oh, it's Australia's biggest, we've got to make sure it's Westfield. It's good to see that um, Westfields actually did have the biggest shopping centre originally, it was Marana, and I think it's fucking way bigger. That Chadston's absolutely huge. All right, so uh, let's go and land a plane now. It would be good to see a legit proper one in the game, though. 
being Australia's biggest shopping centre, you represent some of the best landmarks in Australia, and that's one of them. I think a lot of people would agree with me. You want to represent some of Australia's best landmarks, and uh, you would have to you would have to definitely put the the official biggest shopping centre in Australia in the game. And that thing's been now beaten many times before and it always claims its spot back. So just over here, ladies and gentlemen, uh, as we go through the flight path, there is a Westfield shopping centre over here. There's some really big shopping centres in, in Melbourne, and this is another big one over here. This is a Westfield, and it goes over the highway just here. There it is there. Southland, I think it is, that one. I'm not sure. Yeah, that is Westfield Southland. Ladies and gentlemen, on the uh, the Pean Highway, at uh, Chenham, Chenderham, or whatever they call it. That's it. That's the the one that's gone over the road there. That's the Pean Highway, just there, folks. All right, let's land the plane.
Decimal Niner, Diamond X-Ray, Golf, Sierra. Mora bin ground, Diamond Alpha, Sierra, X-Ray, Golf, Sierra, requesting pushback. Mora bin ground, Diamond Alpha, Sierra, X-Ray, Golf, Sierra, no pushback tug is available to answer your request. Well, there we go, ladies and gentlemen, a nice little tour around uh, Melbourne and uh, showing you the uh, Marvel Stadium that's now in the game uh, as a mod is a pretty good one indeed, ladies and gentlemen. But uh, like I was explaining, I'd like to see some certain things added to the game. And um, i got a few requests. Uh, I want all of the AFL stadiums and the NRL stadiums added to the game uh, around Australia. And um, I want the official um, like buildings and stuff put in each city. Uh, so that would be pretty cool. Uh, Gold Coast is not so bad. You don't need to really touch the Gold Coast because it just looks so damn realistic. It's actually spot on. But the stadium in there obviously needs doing. Um, so, uh, yeah, just a few little things um, need correcting. Uh, it's all hopefully uh, going to be done in due time. Uh, so I will continue to... Uh, uh, stake my cases in and uh, hopefully uh, we'll get somebody to uh, get it all sorted out. From all of us here at GFY's Gaming Australia, my name is Yossi Rainbow. It's been a pleasure giving you some more Microsoft Flight Simulator here on this Friday, um, Monday afternoon. Oh, I do apologize. 7th of September 2020. We'll see you on our next journey. Bye-bye. <laughs>